isomerism. So that day we have done one isomerism. This is called the ionization isomerism. Where you find the anionic ligand, sorry, the counter ions, counter anions, which is outside the coordination sphere, can replace the bonded ligand <clears throat> and form a compound with similar molecular formula. Okay, I have given you the example also that um, with um, cobalt, hmm, tetramine dichlorido, cobalt 3 sulfate, and this ionization isomer is tetramine sulfate of cobalt 3 uh, chloride. Okay, now second one we'll do is the linkage isomer. Hmm. Yeah. This is the second one. Linkage isomer. Is it clear? Can you see? Hello? Yes, sir. Okay. Okay. Can you wipe the camera, sir? <clears throat> By ambient date ligand. This type of isomerism occurs with MB. Then take the gas. Okay. It is, say, I have taken here. Okay, let me draw a structure. The cyanide is bonded through carbon. <clears throat> it is. So it is plus three, these are minus two because of that only plus. So it is tetra mean di cyanido, one word, huh? Cobalt T I. What is this isomer? See here, alphabetically, now both are nitrogen, but this is C and this is H, so it will come, this will come before this. So in this case, see the structure. See, here's the dye source. So it will be dye iso cyanido cobalt 3 
Next one, so it is this CR, CL3, this. This is. Try Florido Try Nitrito and Chromium three. This is a neutral one. See, this is plus three. Oh. <laughs> This is trichlorido tri nitrito O Chromate, green, iron. This is the old name which will be given in, what is the present name? This is the present name. I don't know why in your know, book this has not been edited. So in your know, book, you could write like this only. All these notes that I am sending to you, are you reading from mobile or have you, you have taken taken print out? Hello. I have taken print out, sir. Good boy. <clears throat> Potential chemistry, <clears throat> I have written in detail. So have you gone through? I have given so many examples. Not yet, sir. <laughs> Rubbing this board is also a problem. I don't have now so much strength. Okay. Now we'll go for third category. It's called solvate isomer. Or, as because we carry out this reaction in water, most of the reactions are carried out in water, so we'll call it hydrate isomer. Hydrate isomers. <clears throat> so, what should I write here? This 
type of I'm writing by your own English, eh? whatever I have learned about chemistry, not from the book. This table of isomerism occurs when counter anion. Counter anion means the anion which is outside the coordination sphere, means square bracket. <coughs> replaces the coordinated solvent molecules. Coordinated solvent molecules. <clears throat> that is when you make the compound in water, solvent molecules binds to the central metal atom. And these are being replaced by the, the counter ion. The very famous example is this one. CO H2 6 Cl3. This is called hexa Equa cobalt C fluoride. <clears throat> Here you have plus because this is neutral molecule, plus three, and this is minus three. Now one of the chloride from outside will go and replace one water molecule. This is uh, pale violet in color. Then it will be Cl H2O5 Cl2, one of the water molecule. Now, one of the water molecules is replaced, but this water molecule <coughs> remain associated in the form of water of crystallization. Okay. Okay. This is called penta equa uh, chlorido hmm? penta equa chlorido cobalt C chloride okay but you have to write about this water also. How many molecules of water are there? One. So in that case, we write like this, monohydrate. This is the water of crystallization. From here to here, the name is the complex. I think this is dirty green or something they call grayish green or something like this. Is the spelling correct? Grayish or only S? Yes, sir. Grayish. Green. Then you'll find one more will be replaced. So it is called COCl2 H2O4 Cl2 H2O. All right. So it is. Tetra, Equa, Di, Chlorido, Cobalt, Three, Chloride. This is the example which I given you initially when we have defined the coordination chemistry. So this is one of the oldest uh, coordination compound prepared. And here you'll have dihydrate.
Now we'll come for coordination isomerism. Coordination isomer. Okay. In this, both the cations and anions are coordination entities. <clears throat> the ligands coordinated to the central metal ion undergo partial or complete exchange. Undergo partial or complete exchange within them. Okay, this is a very famous example. Okay. Now what will happen? See here. Acha se dekho. Try to understand. See, why do they write like this? Because they are bonded to nitrogen. In this case, I shall never write like this because hydrogen cannot bind. So always write like this. This atom is bonded. Huh? You can write ulta ultra. See, in this case, the cobalt is bonded to six neutral amino uh, amines. Sorry, ammonia. So what is this charge? Three plus. Hmm. Coordination chemistry is very easy. You can score full marks. See here. Now these are all anionic ligand. Okay, now here I will not write CN because it will be embedded ligand. So what I have to write? C N. C N. Okay, three minus. Now what will happen? All the cyanide, if it comes to cobalt, what will happen? See here, cobalt is plus three. All the cyanide, if it comes, what will happen? Is it on minus three? So, in that case, I will tell you why I am telling you like this. What is this isomer? CR NH36 and CO CN6. So, you may have a feeling that it is the central metal atom has migrated. No. Ligand has migrated. Only because of migration. So this has become negative. Okay. Metal did not migrate. Ligand has migrated. Okay. All right. So it will be just opposite. Hmm. So I will not write the name. You will write the name. After writing the name, you tell me.
So tell me the name. Who is going to tell? Abhijita. Sir, uh, writing. Sir. Oh, writing. ठीक है चाहे लिखो अच्छा तो हमारे जब कोतो देरी हो गया ना ये जल उठाने जुन्ना हो गया बस ता So is it hexamine cobalt hexacyanochromate three? Oh, 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 oh. Hexamine cobalt, hexacyanochromate. Ah. Marega, marega, both marega. Acha oh, bolo. Cobalt three, sir. Ah. Hexamine cobalt three. Ah. Then you did you write give a gap after that? Yes, sir. Acha then after that, hexa. Hexacyanochromate. Uh, we don't call cyanochrome, cyanido. <laughs> Hexamine cobalt three, then gap hexacyanido chromate. Acha. Then what is the name of this? Hmm. Hey, Eugenia. Other though, I do not know whether they're attending or not. Hanania is there. Hmm. School writing. All of their names also I forgot now because they don't talk to me. Hey, Lawan. Lawan, are you there? Daniel? Moinak, Amit. Uh, yes, sir. It's well, the name to key. Hexa amine chromate three space hexa cyanide cobalt. Abar bol, abar bol. Hexa amine chromate three. Hey, why chromate? Uh, uh, chromium three. Uh. And uh, yeah. space hexa cyanide. Uh, cobalt eight three. Yes. Acha. Now here, what did you find? Here you find that only here the complete uh, uh, exchange of the ligand has take, taken place. Okay. Even you'll find that there can be partial also. So I'm going to give you the example of partial. Hmm. Hmm. Yes, sir. See, uh, if if I tell you, then you may feel that Sar is uh, boasting. Mm -hmm. You find any teacher in Shillong who, so so many of your friends are going to different teachers for tuition. You compare with them, how many teachers has given you them, them chapter, summary, then questions, everyone, compare. Hmm. Tarpon Napoleon in the act of body the police near you. So the manager of my chance in it. Yes, only by by appearance of the homo sapiens. But totally prehistoric case. So now we'll go for partial C. P T N H three 
O P T C L four. Okay, this is one. P T C L N H three three. P T C L three. Ammonia. This is also another example. We have to write down the name. Is it dead? Hello? Yes, sir. Ah. Did you write the name? Yes, sir. Oh, no. First one. Tetra amine platinum 2. Yes. Tetra chlorido platinate 2. Very good, girl. Then next one. So I'm still writing the next one. Acha. Hey, Aishman, what are you Aishman. I did not talk to Eva for last three months. Eva Dundar. Eva. Not there. Daniel. Labeth. Hello, Labeth. Then Daiti Nila. Daiti. Pipasha. Yes, sir. Kumbona Namlak, Purata. Unkita. Yes, sir. Hmm. Ki khabar tur? Hmm. Acha. Then Emba is there. Emba. What is Emba? Then Hanania. Damian. Then Oninkita. Estela. This one you have written. Aditi. Oh, Aditi. Yes, sir. Oh, Legion and I. Hmm? You do? So, what do you It's a second to confusion. Is a lot. Key confusion. Hobo. You have to write the name of the ligands in alphabetical order. Whenever the condition, this isomer occurs, the oxidation state of the protein metal does not change. So what will be the problem? See, this is by symbol is nitrogen, but by spelling it is ammonia, A. This is chlorido. So it will come before this. So it is tri amine confusion ro. Triamine chlorido, only one is there. This is cation. So it will be name of the metal will be same as the that of element. 
platinum two. Oxidation state will not change. Then it is next one is what? Only one is there. So we'll write here now. A double M and A N E. I mean, trichloride. This is N I. It will be platinum. Need two. Aditi, to November, December, or fees back here, sir, you November, December. Oh yes, sir. Acha acha. Acha, Mia Bha is still there or what? Mia Bha. I don't know whether she is there or not. Lavan also I have not met him for some several months. Many did not pay for November and December. Eugenia is there. Eugenia. Yes, sir. Hello. Eugenia, yes, you, have, you have paid for November, December, na? Yes, sir. Okay. Omit is Omit. You have already paid for November, December. Sir, December left. I'll pay today, I think. Okay. Okay, now we'll go for the, see, we have done this structural isomerism. Structural isomerism, we have classified into four categories. They are the ionization isomerism, then linkage isomerism, then hydrate isomerism, and the quotation isomerism. Now we'll go for stereo isomerism. So we'll go, we'll go for now stereo isomers. Okay. So first of all, we are going to discuss about geometrical isomers. So in this isomers, what happened? The metal ligand bond does not break. Only their direction in the space is, is changing. Okay. So we'll, lim we'll limit our discussion with four geometrical, uh, uh, sorry, three geometrical figures. Okay. What are those? These are tetrahedral. Square planar and and octahedral. Okay. So we'll go for first tetrahedral. Tetrahedral complexes. Okay. I shall show you to the model.
будет. So this is a complex. Can you see? See here. Oh, sorry. Okay, see here. This is tetrahedral. Okay. So how to show? <laughs> Just become loose. See here. This is the one. You can see now. This is white. Say these two are chlorine, and these two are. Say these two are ammonia. Hmm. Look. Now say. <clears throat> In this one, look here. How to show here? Is it visible to you now? Can you see all the all of them? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Now, see here. Say this yellow one has gone here. If the yellow one is gone, has gone here, see, is it the distance from this one, does, does it change? If the yellow one comes here, distance remains same or not? Same. See, see here, okay. This is one geometry and this is the other geometry. See here. Does the distance change? Same or not? Yes, sir. Huh? Same. So in that case, please remember, the distance from the atoms or molecules or ligands do not change. So please remember, tetrahedral complexes never show geometrical isomers. This is a very important uh, question for exam. Okay, so we'll write it like this. <clears throat> tetrahedral complexes do not exhibit geometrical isomerism because 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 even if the position of ligands ligand changes that Relative distances remain same. Tetrating complex do not exhibit geometric isomerism because even if the position of ligand positions of ligands changes oh. even if the position of the ligand changes their relative distances remain same so we can rule out the tetrahedral complexes No. No. Yes, one son. Ten, sir. Okay. So now we'll go for square prior complexes.
See here now. See, this is the square prime complex. <laughs> I don't have all the models, na. See here. This is the square prime complexes. Okay. See here. This. This is the one. See, all the ligands are same. Even if the exchange is it distinguishable, it is not possible. Now. If I change one, see, wherever I place it, eh, it looks same. So what should I write now? We'll write here, M A4, A is the ligand. And M, a three B. This is three ligands and this is different ligand. Do not exhibit geometrical isomorphism. I write here one. So M, A3, if all the ligands are same, no question of, because even if the exchange takes place, these are not distinguishable. And if three of them are same and one is different, even in that case also, wherever you place, it looks to looks like the original one. So they will not exhibit hmm, geometrical isomerism. Okay? Achha, now, example kya hoga? See, example is, so it is PT CN four. Okay, this is not going to exist. This is MA three. Second one is PT CL three NH. So it is two plus. Not the plus, only plus. This is also, see, this MA3, they are not going to show any geometric isomer. <clears throat> okay, this one I'll explain. Let me show you. P, T, C, L, say it is NH3, C, L, C, L. This is one structure you have drawn. drawn. And you have drawn the other structure. See here. In all these cases, see, see the distance from ammonia and chlorine. This is same. This is the same. So they do not exhibit geometrical isomers. So these are not geometrical isomers. It is the same one. So, have you written? Okay. Now, We'll go for seven. M A two B two. So geometrical isomer. Example, the go. Say it is A A B B. And second one is 
A A B B. See, they are distinguishable. Similar ligand on the same side, and here similar ligand in the opposite side. So this is cis, and this is trans. Example is a very famous example. This di amine di chloride platinum two. See, it is a neutral complex. Ah, huh. minus two plus two. So there, structure is pp. See here. NH3, Cl, Cl, and this is Pt, Cl, Cl, NH3, NH3. Okay. Now you have to write down the name of this one. In exam, they may ask you. So what you write the same name here. But before that, you write here cis. C will be small letter. Huh. Write down this name, whole name here. And here, you write down the whole name. Trans. T will be small. Right. Return. Now see, for examination purpose, this compound is very, very important. It has a common name. It's called cis platine. It is used for the treatment of cancer. So for ex exam, it is very, very important. That's it. Okay. So in your book, only this is given. But let us try to know a little bit more.
So this is what your entrance exam. Suppose you have taken You have taken this compound, PtCl2En. In this case, it is only going to show you cis. You know why? This is for your entrance exam. See here. This is the structure of this. In this case, this ligand can only join like this. It cannot join like this. Why? If it joins like this, the bond length will increase. And in that case, the molecule will break down. OK? So it is not possible. So it is only going to show you cis isomer. OK? So it is. Dichlorido, then on the bracket, ethane one comma two diamine platinum two exists only as cis. Please remember. One more example I can give you. Huh? PTCL2 GLY. Okay. Now, what is GLY? Means glycinato. Uh, don't get nervous. What is glycinato? Okay, I'll do this. This is we get it from the we get it. Okay. See here. This is a negative ligand. So it will be suppose it's plus four is this. So the name of the compound is di chlorido glycinato platinum four oh. this is what this is also this is for your entrance so it is not necessarily that all of them have to show you cis and trans isomer. It depends upon the nature of ligand. So the name will be of this one is what C I S and this is also Cis. Oh sorry. I've already written Cis here. The depth. Can I rub it? Answer. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Sir. 
Click on. Okay. Now, the thing which is not being given in your book, it is M A to B C. Okay, this also shows. Hmm. See, I will find M A A B C. See, similarly done on the same side. So this is this. And here, similar ligand in the opposite side. So this is trans. Example, platinum, Cl2, NH3. Py. Now, what is Py? Py is pyridine. Huh? Don't get scared. Pyridine, I have told you in your organic class. See, this is pyridine, this is aromatic compound. This is neutral ligand. So, the structure is. Cl, Cl, NH3, we'll write here Py. This is C. Then here it is Pt, Cl, Cl, NH3, Py. This is trans. Anyway, this is missing in your book. But whatever will be the thing, you should know. Is cis. Here A will be capital. This C is always sm small. I mean, di chlorido. Then Pyridine, platinum, other one will be trans, other one also you write the name.
Now we'll go for this octahedral complex. So here also we'll find M is six and M a five B do not exhibit geometrical isomers. Second, M a four B two. So I'll write right now here. Let me see whether I have a model or not. Please. Give me some time. All my models are broken by the students. These are all dangerous rogues. Ah, one I have found. This is octahedral complex. Can you see? Uh, see, you can see now? Yes, sir. Ah, see here. This is B2. B2. Are they not on the same side? Whether I keep it like this or I keep it like this, are they not on the same side? See? Same side or not? Yes, sir. So this is cis. And now. See here. Is it not in the opposite side? Yes, sir. Ah, so this is called trans. So I can write here like this. M. See. So it is A, 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 B, B. So C. So this is cis. So this is trans. For example, CO. CL2. NH3. Oh. Okay. So it is plus. Please draw the structure. I'm going 
جال بوشه نیستی نه جال بوشه دیو میتونه یک Mm-hmm. Any product the name also? Hal tan bol dise ni ho re. Lege bhi bol. Dan. See here. C L C L. Why I am again doing because I know what mistake you will do. See here. Nitrogen should be like here. They followed by this. Don't write any string. Okay, don't write like this. It'll be wrong. The atom which is bonded that has to be written first. Okay. Cl. Cl. NH3. NH3. So, good thing. Write the name. Dry amine dichlorido copper. Up, 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 up. Again, again, again. Cis, cis tetra amine ah. uh, dichlorido ah. cobalt. Cobalt what? Two. cobalt two? Six. See here, see. You forgot how to do. Is a Mariana B. See here. Une A. Une B. Une C. So A plus Kamkali. Two B. Une four C. Is equal to what? Plus one. C. This is two into minus one. Ammonia can no charge. Zero. Plus one. So A. Is what? Minus 2 plus 1. So A is equal to what? Is it not plus 3? So it will be what? This is the way to find oxidation state. Hmm? So it is tetraimine dichlorido cobalt 3 iron. Don't buy heart. Okay. Now, dear, I'll show you something like this. Say it is this one. CO then Say this is H2O four. No, sorry, 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 dear. CO EN. Then NH3 O. Now, what is EN? En is what we I write it like exactly like we can more. So NH two CH two CH two NH. See here, this was a neutral. In your book, they written like En En like this. Huh? 
See, we are not uneducated. Hmm. We'll prove that we know everything. In your book, I'll show you how they have written. I will not write like this. So, it will be C O In your book, they have written like this, E N, like this, N, N H T, N H T, N H T, N H T, like this. This is neutral. This is also neutral. In your book, they have written like this. Huh? But ham log bulwak nahi hai. See, I'll show you. Why do you have written like this? Dear, this is a dirented liver. See, this is monodented. If it's dirented ligand, it is like this. See, can you see now? Huh? It's joined from here. So it's same side only. So don't get nervous. Hmm. So I'll show you. We will not write like this. Okay? We know what is what. See here. NH2, NH2. TH2, TH2. This is the one. See? It looks so nice. Hmm? It's just like that I found in Facebook. There are some people out there whose photograph is missing. And many of them, they send friend requests to me. Huh? I do not accept it because I cannot make friendship with ghost. I never accept without photograph. This is the one. So this is what? This is cis. Okay, now what will be the trans one? See here. NH2, CH2, CH2. This. Hmm. Now, in this case, if you write like this, okay, if you write like this, hmm, so we should be what? What is this? Is it cis or trans? Cis. Yes, because that is in that case, this molecule will never show you trans geometry. Why? Because I told you this didentic ligand cannot come like this. They cannot be diagonally opposite to each other because of the strain in the molecule. You cannot stress the bond. Moment it goes across the bond, the bond length increases and this ligand will break. So this molecule will never show you trans. So you will write here. After I write, you will write this and you will write this. Then you will write both the structures are same and they are cis. So this molecule will never show trans geometry. This is for your entrance.
Sí, es todo. Okay. okay, now you please draw the Geometrical isomer of CO, Cl2, remember this hydrate isomerism we have drawn for this one. Ah, please, uh, please draw this isomer. Tetra aqua dichlorido cobalt ion, draw. Are you satisfied with the structure? Hmm? I think so. I think so, no? Let me see. You always don't write this because if you have confusion, don't write this. Because if you write like this, you know they are on the same. Side. Okay. Okay. Now see, in this case, we know oxygen are bonded. So what you'll do? You'll first you write here O. Then you will not make any mistake. No. Then you write here H two, H two, H two, H two. Then you'll find your structure will be perfectly correct because you know. Which atom is bonded? So this is the cis. And here you write here Cl, Cl. Then you write here O. This is the way to write the correct structure. Did you write like this? Hello? Yes, sir. Very good. Okay. Are you feeling hungry? Yes, sir. Achha? Now we'll write this one. COCl2 En2. En2. En2, now you know what is En. So I'll write it like this. CO, C. C here. I'll first will write N. And here I'll write C here. Then what I'll write here? CH2, CH2. CH2, CH2. NH2, NH2. NH2, NH2. See, they're on the same side. Okay, I'll show you. How does it look like? See. It is, see here. This is like this. Okay, this is like this and this is like this. And here you have two CL. Yeah. Every ultra no ah like this. One CL, one CL. This is this, and this is this. Now see here. This. So we'll write down here. 
sorry this is the d will be capital here dichlorido bis methane 1 comma 2 see here diamine m will be single diamine cobalt d i okay then we'll write the trans so trans what will happen this cl and this cl will be opposite so now here you write n n n n h2 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 ch2 ch2 okay now when you become okay when you become a little expert now so you need not write ch2 because you know this itself is ch2 okay now so you have become expert ch2 so let it ah so now here also you need not write see so the problem finish this is CH2. See, it looks so nice. What should you write E and E N? So here you will write the same name, but it will be trans. Write the same name again. Very good. Okay. Now I will write. Here you will write now. C two O four C R. This is three minus. Or you may have to write like this. C R C L two O X two three minus. Now what is O X? O X is oxalate. So what is this? C two O four two minus. How does it look like? In your book, they find they were an ox. Balai ox. We are not going for ox and cow business. So what do you write now here? CR. See, now we know it is the oxygen which is bonded. Okay? So, O, O. O, O. This is C. So, what is this? See, this too. I did not write the carbon. Finish. So what will be the name here? Di chlorido di oxalato chromate T I. So you write this structure by yourself. Okay, I'll write. Because some of your friends, I think, 
they are not attending the class after that they'll show the video so in for them only i have to do something those prince and princess See, every structure will have only one C but they may have more than one geometrical isomers, sorry, trans isomers. So this is note. Every coordination entity will have only one C isomer, but may have more than one trans isomer because here you have seen all of them are showing one. Okay, so you should be aware of it. Say, you have taken here COCl2 EN NH3 2 this. Too much. See here. You yourself can write it. We know how the similar ligands in the opposite side are called trans. So I'll write here now. See you. See ya. Uh, 
I write it like this. This is cis. They're on the same side. See here again. Small molecule fell down, bro. Up, she pang mo. These are red is say, e n. This one. Okay. Then this is CL, this is CL. This is NH3, this is NH3. They are on the same side. Now see here. See, now I will put CL across. But ammonia are on the same side. Then ammonia are opposite. Okay. See here. So how many trans you have? This is one trans and this is the other trans. I think Now, the structure that you will draw. Hmm, I know you are getting a little angry with me. What to do? Hmm. Br2, Cl2, Ox. One, three minus. Okay, this is your homework. And we see you on Thursday. Mm, Thursday, Shumna told me that uh, classes uh, he will, mm, will not be there, but I'll tell Shumna that on Thursday we'll meet. Tomorrow, to one holiday is there. Uh, birthday of Kyang Nongba. So, class 11, I'll not take, but I'll, Thursday, I'll take. Then I'll see you in. 2021. Hope everything will be fine. Okay, then bye for today. Okay, and today, though, almost half an hour I have wasted what to do for domestic affairs. Please remember, this is your homework.